And officials with ProMedica want you to beat the heat and check the back seat. Zainab Shaib joins us live outside ProMedica headquarters with how serious it can be to leave a child in a hot car. Zainab, how often does this happen and what can we do to make sure it doesn't? Kaylee, now one death is way too much, but last year, 33 children died because they were left in a hot car. Now with temperatures rising, officials with ProMedica wants to remind parents and caregivers to always check the back seat before leaving your car. When it's as hot as it's going to be today, it's important to be vigilant as ever when it comes to heat safety. A child's body heat can rise three to five times faster than an adult's body. When a child's temperature reaches 104 degrees, major organs start to shut down and when it reaches 107 degrees, the effects can be deadly. It only takes a few minutes before temperatures begin to climb to dangerous levels when a car is turned off and windows are rolled up, which can turn deadly for kids. Here are a few tips from officials uh, on ProMedica before leaving your car. You should always check the back seat. If running errands, never leave a child in the car alone for obvious safety reasons, but especially during the hot and humid weather and create a visual reminder that a child is a passenger in your car. Parents are going to their child care preschool and they're tending to forget them in the back just because they get sidetracked on their way to work. So um, things that they can look out for is just to kind of remember taking those reminders, uh, act so like acting on it and then creating those reminders and then taking action obviously if you see something. But yes, maybe putting a book bag, maybe even a shoe if you want to drive to work with one shoe or a diaper bag, anything like that that will help you. And remember that inside your car is usually 20 degrees hotter than what it is outside and that temperature can rise within 10 minutes. Now for more uh, safety tips, you can always check out our website at WTOL.com. Live in downtown Toledo, Zainab Shahid for WTOL 11.